Hey aphrodisiacs, it's me Khadija. So today I'm going to show you guys how I refresh my hair midweek without rewashing or co-washing. Since I have high porosity hair that's prone to excessive dryness, matting, tangling, I really like to refresh my hair midweek and some of the benefits of that are I get to re-moisturize without having to do the whole wash day process again, detangle, remove my shed hairs, give me some more curl definition and also to extend the longevity of my hairstyle. <music> So typically I refresh my hair on day 3 or 4. On day 3 my hair looks like this, it's pretty much tangled, cuticles are kind of raised as you can see all that frizz and it just can use a lot more moisture. Sometimes I refresh on day 4 if I'm being lazy but typically day 3 is best because my hair is not at its worst as where on day 4 it's definitely at its worst. So to start this process, I'm going to need my leave-in conditioner or refresher. I'm using the Shea Moisture Curling Style Milk. Then as my cream, I'm using the Marguerite Magic by Carol's Daughter. This cream is very thick and heavy, which is great for my hair. And then as for oil, I'm using the Hydrotherma Naturals Hair Growth Oil. I like this oil, but I still like to use extra virgin olive oil because it's just more easily accessible and cheaper and I go through products really fast. So as you guys can see, I just wet my hair a little bit and now I'm starting my detangling process. I wanted to do this in slow-mo so that you guys can see how badly my hair gets tangled. So all I'm going to do is just finger detangle and pretty much smooth my hair out because that's the problem. My cuticles are extremely raised and rough so smoothing really helps to get my hair back to a manageable place. So I'm just going to repeat this process all over my hair, adding water, my leave-in, my cream, my oil, and then twisting. So after twisting, I like to go in with my Jamaican black castor oil and apply that to my edges. I like this because it's really good for thickening up your edges and keeping them healthy. And also, as you guys can see, it keeps my edges laid so I don't have to use gel on my edges. So this is what my hair looks like. I have 8 twists in total and now I'm just going to wait about 2 hours. I don't like to go to sleep on my hair soaking wet. And then after 2 hours, I slap on my bonnet and I go to sleep, you guys. Hey guys, so today is the next day and my hair is 100% dry and I'm just going to take that Hydrotherma Naturals oil and put a little bit of that on my hands and apply it to my hair before taking out my twist. So now I'm just taking out my twist and then I'm going to separate, fluff, and pick it out and give my hair some shape and that is pretty much it you guys. So like I said, I do this process every day three when my hair is like super matted and dry and pretty much I get a week out of this hairstyle using this technique. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, then please like, comment, share, and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys! Yeah.